Since transportation is changing and we must adapt, this is what we should be doing. We have been developing an electric three-wheeler with special consideration for the elderly and disabled. Through all the surveys and research done, we came up with many difficulties which the physical impaired faced which are to be considered and also needs a solution to it. The extra fabrication to make the vehicle suitable for physically challenged varies between 10,000 to 50,000. A first proof of concept. Feedback for the first prototype. Here, the working of the simulation is shown with the variation in graph of SOC, speed, current and voltage which is completed in a time interval of 3 hours. With the help of customers' feedback and suggestions given by the evaluators, we have modified the first proof of concept and designed the second proof of concept. The vehicle is equipped with a smart display that shows fault detection, battery consumption, range and all other important vehicle information. According to the physically abled, the vehicle has seat belts so that everyone is restrained when driving. We have made the seat movable and have given it a unique design that allows for horizontal movement as well. Here the seat may be adjusted in height so that those with physically disabilities can utilize it without difficulty. The vehicle has an extended trolley that can be used for storage and business purpose. The multipurpose electric vehicle is made compact which includes features like smart display, solar panel, expandable multipurpose trolley, anti-skid tyre, battery space, handbrake and rotating seat and seat belt. This is how we started with making of prototype of EcoVent from scratch. We have assembled the prismatic lithium ion battery which is German certified on our own at our workplace. The working of the app. This is the login page where we need to log in through the vehicle ID and password. Then we have the vehicle controlling system where it shows the total distance travelled and where the mode can be switched. Here we can automatically start the vehicle, we have the cruise control and can even locate the vehicle where it is exactly present. Then we have the battery information where the battery percentage left is shown along with the battery temperature and most importantly the battery security can be turned on. Here we have the vehicle fault detection system wherein the throttle fault, controller fault, VLDC, overload fault and wire check features are available. And we also have the AR scanning for checking vehicle connections. Thank you.